gentlemen, welcome to London. Luton with the local time is 10 minutes to 1. That's 5 minutes ahead of schedule. Please remain in your seat with your seatbelt securely fastened until the captain switches off the seatbelt sign. This is important as you may have to stop suddenly or taxi into the terminal. Good morning. <laughs> it is 4.30 a.m. 4.33 to be exact. Um, Sam, Sam and I, say hi Sam. Hi Sam. <laughs> We're off to the airport. Um, we're on a, are we on a business trip. Business trip. Business trip. A business. We've got some business to take care of. Um, <coughs> I like that. I like that. We've got some business to take care of, yeah. I like that. It's good. It's good. Busy, busy bees. Busy bees. Um, so yeah, black we're just. And yellow, <laughs> black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. We're firing over, over the bridge. Kick Garden. Kick Garden, but no. Yeah, no. Not Kick Garden Bridge. What are we talking over about? Over Troubled Water. I don't know where I am. It's too early in the morning for this. Um, and we're off to the airport. So, uh, yeah. It's too early. I'll check in again when we get to the airport. We all have many hours to kill. Because, um, you know, international air travel, and all, well, domestic air travel and all, means you have to get to the airport at stupid o'clock in the morning. Um, so, yeah, uh, well. <laughs> I'll see you soon. That's fine. Good morning, Samuel. Hello. <laughs> How sleepy are we today? Sleep is every day. Sleep is every day. Okay. Not my uh, sunglasses to hide the fact that I'm sleeping. We've, I mean, uh, we've come out at this time in the morning to visit um, one of the best video game venues in the UK. Is the camera on me? Uh, it is on you. Yeah, yeah. So I can look properly unimpressed. Yeah, yeah. Um, we'd like to introduce everybody to the fantastic Game Zone. <laughs> Um, by Sims Auto uh, Automatic. I thought we were going to one life left. No, we're not. Go we're no, we're going to Game Zone. This is uh, this is it. We woke up at 4:30 in the morning to arrive here at Game Zone. Um, we're very pleased to be here. Look at their amazing range of games like Sega Rally 3, uh, Transformers Human Alliance, Mini Football. Look at this. Look at this thing. This man has no arm. Poor little guy. Um, <clears throat> yeah, best arcade in the UK. Totally come check it out. There's a Sega UFO catcher, of course, the classic, filled with many things. Um, so yeah, that's the uh, center of the party. <laughs> so, you happy to be here? I'm unimpressed with both their games and their zone. Oh. <laughs> Well, that's uh, top advice from a um, seasoned arcade employee. Thanks, Sam. covered in cayenne. What? Seasoned. Oh, right, okay. Pepper. Pepper. <laughs> it's 4.30. It's 4.30 in the morning. Our jokes don't get any better than that. I don't know. Transformers looks like it's worth a go. No, it doesn't. It really doesn't. Uh, anyway. This is us at Game Zone. Uh, it's the end of our trip. We're going to head home now. So thanks very much. We'll see you later. Bye bye. So our flight is in. Um, one hour and forty minutes. No, fifty. One hour forty-five minutes. So we still have a while to tell. This is a discussion we were having last night um, with with Dean, Sam's uh, house husband. The next employee of <laughs> Uh, number four in the employee food chain at our case. Uh, <laughs> Mind you, Michelle, and a cat box? No, Yoshi, don't forget Yoshi. <laughs> I wouldn't consider the cat box as the logo. Oh, it, does, it doesn't feel this way. Um, it does if you pay it. <laughs> it. The kids like it more than anyone, any of us, actually. So if it was down to the popularity... It takes some money. It takes all the money, but if it was down to popularity, I'd say the cat box is... Um, although the cat box has been stolen, it's now the panda box. Oh, yeah. I see the panda box is number one in the stakes. Um, their stakes. Their stakes are high. Um, stakes covered in CBD medium oil. Medium rare. <clears throat> CBD oil. Yeah. The stakes are high. <laughs> oh, right. that's not what it does. I redownloaded Doodle God. Doodle God. Do you know Doodle God? I do not know Doodle God. It's really hard to say with a mouthful of porridge. Doodle God. Say it three times fast. You're God, you're God, Every God is the same. <laughs> That's what you find out when you look at religion enough. All gods are the same man. Or woman. Deity. Diana. 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 Diana.
Dianity. 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 Um, yeah, so we're going to go down and invade One Life Left. They don't know about it. Well, Ash from One Life Left knows about it. I messaged Ash um, a month ago to say that we're coming down. Um, She's forgotten. Actually, probably no. has actually. It's going to be a surprise for her too again. Um, John has no idea. John um, is the owner of One Life Left. John, the owner of One Life Left. Um, of who I class as a, as a good friend now. We've chatted many times through the internet. Um, I'm intrigued to know <coughs> your criteria for good friends. Well, I, uh, I connect with John on a video game level and a business owner level. Um, I feel a lot of what John goes through with his business is what I go through with my business. Um, he's like me, but white, um, but then six months ahead of where I am. Hello, right here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like you, but white. And 15 years in the past. <laughs> <laughs> That's some quick maths there. Quick um, maths. Quick maths. 34 minus 19. 15! Um, For anyone who didn't know. I'm 34, he's 19. Yeah, that's the... Should be the other way around, this really. Is, if this was three years ago, this would be pre... <laughs> I'm just preening you and taking you on a business trip. We're going to Norwich saying? for tackles. <laughs> oh, man. Um, so yeah, we're, we're going to go down to One Life Left and, um, and surprise them. With that um, being said... No, I've seen that one before, I didn't need that again, thank you. He's memeing me. He's memeing me again, stop singing, oh my god. Mm, me, me. <laughs> Talking about memes, memes. Um, <laughs> there it is. Yeah, so we're gonna go to, it's too early in the morning for us to be recording videos and I have no brain life power and the cords not kicking in fast enough. I am roll. I'm also on a roll. On my way to one left left to take some ass. Who says I can't do promos? Thank you for rolling with us. I don't know, roll with it was that ours or sad. <laughs> um, yeah, the reason for this, not the reason for this trip, the reason for this trip is because, you know, gonna be funny. Um, but um, we're celebrating the arcades, not arcades, but the uh, our challenge series versus series um, is running, re re returning for season three. Crazy controls mm. and crazier koalas. So this time John and I decided that, um, well John does these crazy control events where you come along to One Life Left and, uh, and you take part in a tournament. Um, but the controls are all messed up, so somebody's blindfolded, or somebody has to eat a certain amount of Maltesers um, oh. while they're playing, or... Are you bashing your thumbs before it starts? Yeah, um, so the Crazy Controls, I've seen John's um, event for Crazy Controls, and I thought that would be really cool for uh, for our online series. Season 1 and 2 was just sort of straight up video game challenges, but to change it up a bit, I thought season 3 should be something a bit different. And, uh, and I also wanted to open it up to the public as well, so that everyone else could take part. Um, and it wasn't just us versus them, um, it was all of us versus all of them, um, which would be, I think is really cool. So yeah, that's kicking off um, this week actually. I timed that well, because um, I hadn't actually arranged when Season 3 was going to start with John. We talked about what we wanted to do, but we hadn't sort of penciled down a date yet. Um, and then I booked this trip. Um, and decided to, to kick it off this week as well, so it's timed very well. That were that was that was so planned. My hair is very clippy. My hair is a very I don't know what's going on with my hair. It's very wavy this morning. I don't know. My hair either looks really good when I wake up or really good when I'm just about to go to sleep. It feels and like we're never never both. It feels like we're recording a podcast. Right? We are recording a podcast. No, we're recording B roll that we're not gonna use. So I'll use it. Oh. Just jab a spoon into it. No, with a headphone. Yeah. Why did you say that? I don't know. I um, said out for my headphone. Accessible toilets over there. Actual toilets are around there. 
What do you mean actual toilet? <clears throat> Slightly smaller toilets around there. Oh. Huh. But how can I get into them? If those are the only ones that are accessible. It doesn't say that they're inaccessible. They just may be harder to access. Anyway, that's enough I'm gonna, nonsense talking. I'm gonna go Okay, so much weirdness. <laughs> the entire corridor, the entire bloody airport is empty. It's just really weird. Oh God, <laughs> except for this um, bearded gentleman. Uh, I'm the Naked Deli. I am the Naked Deli. That should be a wrestling name. <laughs> There's nobody here. It's really creepy. Honestly, it's like, ah, oh, we can go back out this way. <laughs> Let's just go home. <laughs> <laughs> nope, Samuel. <laughs> anyway. Ah, more people, good, okay. I think that's our plane way over there. You can't see out the window because of the glare, because the camera doesn't work like that. It's just Sam, you're the plane. Fly, Sam, fly. <laughs> anyway, there are some people, but there's nobody. Actually, just a sort of I think we've got an entire plane to ourselves. This is our private jet. We'll have to sit me on one side and you plus seven sandbags on the other. It's our private easy jet. Anyway, we're off now. We're nearly there. And my arm is getting tired holding two bags, so. Bye now! Um, hello. hello. We made it to London. Londonium. Londonium. We're in Stansted. Um, we just there. just got off the <laughs> just got off the plane. Um, slight um, thing. We uh, so we got to the airport two and a half hours early for the flight. Very organised. Well done, Sam. Supposed to be. Thank you. And I booked taxi to get to the airport way too early. Yeah. So no, we were there way on, too early. We were there good. on time. Good. Yeah. We got something to drink before we went through security because Andy's a smoky smoky. <laughs> so we had uh, save time for that, and we went through security. And you can regale us with the tale of how we almost <laughs> this entire thing. <laughs> are we, are that we might, using the word? I'll, I'll be beat that out. That's fine. Um, yeah. So we had breakfast. I had porridge. You had. Uh, a, you may have seen this. A roll. Um, and then uh, we went through security um, and decided to sit and have a drink because there was still we didn't have a gate yet at that point. This was about an hour and fifteen minutes before the flight was due to leave. Um, being as nonchalant as I am, I uh, I saw the gate number come up on my phone uh, and chose not to ignore, not to ignore, but not to hurry myself along. Um, finished partially, finished my drink, and then we left to go to the gate. Um, and it was unbearably quiet, and we were wondering really why is that. Got to the gate. Um, turns out we were 15 minutes late. <laughs> no, we were we were on time for. No, I checked. We were, we were 15 minutes before the flight left. Yeah, but they, they closed open the gate half an hour before and then close it 20 minutes before. No, no, I checked the app actually. They closed the gate 30 minutes before the flight is due to leave, so we were supposed to be there at quarter two. So we were there at. We were there 15 minutes late. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. With the flight leaving and at 10. And the hours. airplane was boarded. Everyone was there. Um, we're the only ones in the gate. There's no EasyJet staff. We're just standing there all alone, um, looking lost and asking everybody for help. Um, luckily, I like I stood at the window and did like puppy dog eyes at the airplane, and I think one of the stewardesses um, saw us uh, and sent one of the staff, one of the guys, out to come and collect us. Because the plane had to wait on the runway for an extra half hour for de-icing. <laughs> it was, it was, it was ice. Yeah, so, so we got <laughs> saved. We by were saved by ice. <laughs> Uh, but that being said, we have two hours to get to our bus, so um, I think we better get a move on. on. <laughs> <sighs> we made it to the hotel. We're very sleepy. The bus ride was long. I was asleep. Sam was sleeping. It was funny. Um, you you fell asleep watching wrestling, didn't you? Yep. Yeah. Um, but we're here. We made it. We're uh. We're in Norwich. Um, we had a quick whip round the the local shops where uh, where we're staying. So we're we're staying just at the bus station actually, so that. Um, I bought a on, banana on, on, on Wednesday when we leave. 
Um, we literally just have to roll out the door into the bus because um, we have to leave at five in the morning. <sighs> Things I do for arcade. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the view from outside. Um, our view from our hotel is is fantastic. That is the uh, that's the bus station. We there's a bus. There it is. A little bus. So our view from our hotel is the bus station. <laughs> This is where we got off our bus. Um, <laughs> and this is where we'll get on our bus on Wednesday again. So convenience, it's beautiful. Um, Sam is apparently sleeping in this. There's Sam already made himself at home. Um, ours, I'm he's, trash. He's given me this massive bed of awesome. So we're uh, we're gonna head up to One Life Left now. I think that's the plan. I'm gonna go surprise John. He has no idea we're coming. Um, so this should be hilarious. I haven't mentioned that in the video yet. Everything that's happened today. It's only two o'clock and so much has happened today. I'm gonna to put the camera down here. It's gonna be it's gonna be nice there, see. Um there's Sam just here. Ta -da. Um but it feels like today's been stupidly long. Um which it has been so far. Oh yes. Um so we're gonna to go to one life left now, so we'll do a little walk up video I think on the way there. I'm just gonna look up how to get there. Um it's about ten minutes from where we are, I think. According to Google Maps. Um, so yeah, well, uh, yeah, walking time. Andy. Hello internet, what, what's happened to your phone Sam? Look at Sam's phone. What's this? <laughs> it's gone landscape portrait, no, no, no. Um, so yeah, we're on our way to, to One Life Left. Uh, we're just passing Cathedral, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna do this. St. Peter Mancroft, Chapel of England. Ta-da! There you go. Came out of nowhere. Like that thing. It's pretty sweet. Um, so yeah, there's stuff here. Oh, television and movie store. <gasps> Look at that. Memorabilia's. Um, and then the cinema. Seems like that's the forum. It's called. Massive cinema behind me. So. Oh, that's cool. I've seen this lights up at night. It looks like it does. Yeah, man. Till I killed it. No, sorry, bro. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, I can't flip the camera. Although well, I could do this. Ta da! That's pretty cool, man. Wow. Um, so we're yeah we're on our way to to one of the flats. Hi Sam, what have you got? Gifts. It's got big tea. Some big tea cups. Some big tea. Teas. Big tea cups. <laughs> What's with you today? Me? I don't know. I'm going to have to beep out more of you. I didn't say anything about it. some big titty cups. So yeah, we're on our way down now. This um, is the market. This is one of the things oh, is there a market to thing? Look. Cool. See, we're never going to make it to One Life Left like this. Um, yeah, that's not going to happen. I'm going to have, again, I'll flip the camera around. You can have a look at this really cool stuff. That's the cutest little market I've ever seen. It's uh, Britain's best large outdoor market 2019. Well done guys, well done. Um, Big Lloyd's Bank in the background there. Um, that's my new house over there, are we living in that? What's this big building? Oh, it's the city council building, of course, because you know, they have the big fancy buildings. Because um, they have the money, all of our money, to do that. Um, but yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> and, hello, local wildlife. Hello. No. No. <laughs> I actually really want to go to the market. We can go tomorrow. We've got loads of time. We're going to head down that little alleyway over there in, in the distance so we can oh, see it. Oh, the yeah, the pretty one with the lights. We're going I down have, there. Just for reference, by the way, how dedicated I am to my job. I have a bottle cap in my back pocket with the lights this weekend. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're on our way. Well, uh, I think we're about five minutes away, I think, off the top of my head. I need to double check Google Maps again, but I'm busy. There's steps. Dink. Dink. Five, six, seven, eight. My boots scooting, baby. It's driving me crazy. Why? You hate me so, Samuel. You're wearing sunglasses. You agree we would wear sunglasses. I'm wearing normal glasses. I can't really do much about that. Sorry that my glasses are not sun spec for you. So, uh, yeah, we're heading down that alleyway that I just pointed out on the camera. Because um, I think One Life Left is that way. What street are we on now? Yes. This is St Giles Street. <clears throat> I keep getting buzzy buzzy notifications. Um, because... Um, 
Google Maps is still trying to direct me. There's a charity shop this way, Sam. We've already been to like five charity shops and we've not been here more than an hour. We have plenty of time tomorrow. We'll just head because this is the way we need to go. Um, down this way and then hang a left on uh, St. Benedict Street. See, I mean, oh, much bikey, big, big. There you go. Barber. I'm going to flip it again because this is really cool. <laughs> Why is your gaming cafe not down here, John? Huh? Why is there a gaming cafe? That, yeah, I know. Okay, that's fair. Because it's expensive. Um, but yeah, it's so pretty. I don't know. Lunch deal. It seems like a cafe of some kind. Hold up. Tea! <coughs> this is um, Biddy's Tea Room, Vintage Tea House. It's a mambo thing. I think it's a dance, dance room. <gasps> Roman! This is Chef Ron's kitchen, that smells amazing. What is that? I think it's the falafel bar, it smells amazing. It is. There's so many things to eat. Nice. Oh, and a car. More what? Strangers Coffee Company. They have a few actually, we've seen a couple of those as we've gone. Uh, Mod 1, SMOK, Belgian Monk. It's just really cool down here. So I mean our hotel is in like the student just area. the student area with like the main shops like uh, Primark and Subway and all that kind of stuff and then we've discovered all this. I think this is the right way. No idea. Fine city sounds. We surplus store as well. There you go. Sorry I'm terrible with the camera. I have 4% battery system. Oh no! I've not planned this well, so I'll check that we're going the right way. I'm I can, no, don't do that. I, I know we're going the right way. You sure? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <gasps> Antiques and collectibles. Oh, I really want to go in there. Look at that tree. There's so much. There's so much. Um, oh, let's leave it there. Bang! Um, yeah. This is really cool. Okay. And I think we take a left here. Yeah, because we're on the left hand side. Huh? Oh, there's Athena Games. Because um, Athena Games is just around the corner from One Life Left. And, ooh, movie shop. Cool. There's so many cool shops around that here. There's like memorabilia shops, there's pop and film memorabilia, frameworks, all sorts of stuff. Um, so this is St. Benedict Street then, I assume. Yes, it is. That means One Life Left is over that way. One Life Left. One Life Left, my nose is getting blocked. Um, yeah, so we're going this way. What a shame if it's like... What? Closed? Like, gone out of business. <laughs> gone out of business. <laughs> well, I spoke to John today. I didn't tell him we were coming, but I spoke to John, so I know that he's in the shop and they're open. Um, so I, I don't think that's going to be an issue. Cookies Pianos. No, Cook's Pianos. Sorry, I put an eye in there because I was excited. So excited. There's one left, right there. Behind that silver van. I can't see because I'm wearing sunglasses. <laughs> oh, it's the music shop. Okay. This is so cool. I remember um, John telling me that they had like a street party here. Sin Sins, Boutique of Love. Oh my. The taco place? Yeah. I'll find this one. You'll find it. There's so many cool little shops. Oh, wow. Um, yeah. Incroyable. <coughs> okay, so John wins prize for best area. I mean, there's a freaking awesome church next door. So many cool little shops. Are we just going to walk in like this now? Recording, yeah? Are you recording me now? Yeah, I was doing it. Okay, that's fine. Um, so John's about to get a surprise. This is going to be funny. So here's one life left, and uh, gonna have a wee peek. I don't see John. That's worrying. Oh no, he is. He's behind the bar. Should we just go in? You ready for this? Yeah, I'm. I'm okay, we're going in. Let's see what happens. Get the door. <laughs> Hello, John. What? <laughs>
Hello. What are you doing here? You're like the, the wrong side of the country. We've been told that they won't take our they money won't here. Take our money here is really annoying. Why? Because um, we're foreigners. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, we're foreigners. Sadly. A belated happy birthday for you, sir. Oh my god. Um, what? I didn't. <laughs> I didn't pre. Pack anything so you get this. I'm gonna pass it over to Sam so I can actually talk to John now. So. The hell? Um, yeah. Hello, thank you. Oh. How are you? This is embarrassing. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hello. What's this? Accentuate is one of our favourite games at Arcade of Fights. I think we're not very good. Can't awesome. be practice your Scottish accent as well. This is this as well? Yeah. Let's oh. buy some Tetris. Yes, I know you love your Tetris. So. Of course, those staples. <laughs> what are you doing? Tetris Jewels. Again, I don't know if you've seen it before. I have not. We've run out of challenges. So. Yeah, so tabletop Tetris. Um, I have like physical fisticuffs over here. <laughs> and one of our all new arcade gift cards. Just in case you're in the area, you know. Like, yeah. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's a well smarter than our one. Oh my god. There you go. Happy birthday. Amazing. Thank you. What? Good to finally actually meet you guys as well. So, um, we're in a weird bar. John, uh, <laughs> John just closed up for the night. It is now Tuesday, the second day that we're here. Um, we are leaving tomorrow early, but um, John, after closing the shop, decided um, we should just go out for a drink. And I'm totally, I'm happy he did. It's probably the weirdest little place. We're just gonna come out the bathroom in the middle of doing a video. Very weird. We have a lot of um, So yeah, this is the weirdest place I've ever been. It's incredible. Um, hi Sam. Hi, Sam. Hi, John. <laughs> it's... it's I, I, I can't even... Have a look at the, the bit out I'll, the I'll go... Front. Yeah, no, it's a good idea. I'll, I'll, I'll run through and um, do the thing. Um, so, let them talk while I um, show everybody how this looks. Very strange. Hello, sir. How are we? Yes? Are you lounged out quite happily, yeah? Um, what's the what's the, what's the young man's name? Uh, Dylan. 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 Yes. Hello, Dylan. Sorry, I'm taking a video. If that's okay, I don't. We don't mind at all. He's just really unphotogenic. Oh, it's no. He's lovely. The issue is, is that he's in proportion, so he just makes everything around you look smaller. Yeah, I feel much smaller now. It's, it's annoying being six foot tall. You think everything is is uh, is tiny, and so. I never meant to feel like make you feel inadequate. <laughs> no, thank you very much. No. Um, Yes, sorry, I'm just going to run around and, and, and show everyone how amazing your place is. Um, it's it's something else. I'm, uh, it's a normal for Norfolk at the very least. I'm completely flabbergasted. It's, it's incredible. I'm going to quickly do a quick whip around the front room. Thank you, my friend. So, um, yes, indeed. Whoop. So it's, um, it's fake Christmas week um, at Arbitorium. Don't mind me guys, I won't get you in my video, don't worry. <laughs> um, but it's, it's madness. It's this dapper gentleman. Nip out the front door to show you, and I'll come back in. Oops, oh, I could do that. Um, so yeah, I can't even remember the name of this this lovely place, but uh, it pays to buy good tea apparently. So the entire window and the entire door, they're all boarded up. It's kind of this weird underground um, bar uh, that doesn't have a sign, and nobody knows what it is or where it is. I'm gonna cross the road so you can see. Um, coffee. Um, so yeah, John's brought us here. I, I passed this earlier and I was like, that's weird. That shop seems to be closed down. I wonder if it's for rent. Um, and then John brought us here and you go inside and this happens. Incredible. Anyway, I'm gonna go join, join John and um, Sam again. Hello again. We need to stop eating. <laughs> we really do. You look so comfortable, sir. <laughs> Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Um, 
um, yeah, everything is also for sale, I've been told. Hello. Yeah, anyway. Um, Sam, quickly your thoughts on this wonderful venue? I'm recommending Norwich. Indeed. How have you go, sir? Because it's cool. I genuinely have also been saying that if. Uh, so I own a Golden Grant. We've established that. I think we have. Uh, and I would <laughs> Indeed. at some point like to open one in Glasgow because obviously that's where I'm from. But I was like, can I somehow turn that into opening one in Norwich as well? Yeah, so far, it's been, why not? Franchise it now. Very interesting. I'll, I'll say that. I'll franchise it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll be your, your Norwich brand, your branch. I appreciate that. Here we are. So, um, yes, thank you, John, for, uh, for bringing us here. Um, I'll, uh, I'll catch up later. Yes, I'll stop here. Bye. Say thanks. Say thanks. To you, the phone, or John? All three. All of us. I want to say thanks to the dog. Okay. Yeah. Dylan, his name is Dylan. <laughs> I, I, I Bye, Dylan. Go to the airport. Bye. <laughs>